Hi Jurassic Cuties, Wayne here. Today we're going to draw Lisa from Blackpink's ice cream video. So let's get started. To draw Lisa, let's first start by drawing a bottom of a U for her face. So I'm going to come right here. Start. Come right across. Oh, about this much. And connect at the bottom. There. So a basic bottom of a U. From there, let's come back to where we started and I'm going to draw a circle for her eyes. And come right across and do the same thing on the other side. Okay, so then let's make them draw so cute eyes. They're going to come in here with two small circles for highlights and a curved line at the bottom and shade in the top. And lines at the bottom and same thing over here. From there, let's spruce up her eyes with some lashes. So I'm going to come to the side right here and just draw a long curve and then thicken it up. And then at the top right here, I'm just going to add two more smaller ones. So same thing over here, a long one kind of like her eyeliner or it could be a lash <laughs> and two more at the top, smaller ones. And let's give her a sweet smile. So about right here. Go ahead and draw a soft curve and cap it off. Then let's come to where her eyes are. We're going to draw her ears. So by in this area, I'm going to go ahead and pop out a curve per ear. Come in here with two small curves for some details and same thing over here. Okay, so now we have our ears in. Let's come back to the top and right above her eyes is we're going to start to draw her bangs. So right here, basically drawing a curve right across, but you're breaking it up with these little um, points in here. So I just go right across here and there. I'm just going to break it up. But we're still going at a curve. So maybe when you're coming on this side, the curves could be more this way and on this side curves this way where this is the center point. Okay, so then let's bring this up and here as well. And let's see here, just imagine this being nice and round for her bang. So let's bring this up, let's say about right here in the center and I'm just going to go ahead and connect it. This is easier for my hand to come down. Okay, so then let's come up right here in the center. Go up again right here in the center. We're going to draw the, the rest of her head. Center line and we're just going to bring this up. And right here, just tuck it in. And in this area, I'm stopping because um, she has this little bun thing going on, right? So right here, same thing over here. Okay, so I'm going to stop, uh, but if you're using a pencil, definitely go ahead and continue this curve. But I'll stop, say, about right here, and I'm just going to draw this little flower decoration that she has in this 
um, bun thing going on and then I'll go ahead and finish it off and then right here I'm just going to add these curves just to make it look like her hair has been curled into these strands. There's really no wrong or right way. It's just this little <laughs> mound of <laughs> curves right there at the top. So same thing over here. Start with the flower first. And then just finish it up, the hair. And then once again, just add this shapes. There. Okay, so we're done with that part. Now we can go ahead and her hair is gonna come out about right here, but I'll draw the rest of her hair after I finish her body. So right in the center, let's give her a little neck and then come out for her shoulders. Same thing over here. So then I'm just gonna break this up right now since I'm here for her neckline. And just imagine her armpit area a bit right there and there. And from there, we're gonna go ahead and draw a slight angle line. So using this as my the armpit area, I'm gonna go ahead and come right across and draw her top. So right towards the center and same thing on the other side. Let's bring this down more for her Top, her waist area and then about right here I'm gonna go ahead and do the same thing wobble for her top and pop this out if you like okay, so we've created her top and then let's bring this down a little bit more and connect it so this is gonna be the beginning of her skirt right there so let's bring her skirt down. So let's continue bringing her skirt down and I'm just gonna widen it out a little bit and bring it in. So then about right there, I'm gonna go ahead and curve. So the center is gonna be lower. I'm gonna curve and about right here, I'll give it a little slit and continue. Okay, so then we can draw her legs. So nice and center, I'm just having her legs apart. Hip. Let's work on this side first. So just come down. And same thing here, and we're just gonna get thinner as we come down. And about right there, go ahead and connect. I'm just giving her a very simple pair of boots. And just bring it down and come out with a curve and connect. So same thing over here. Or they could be socks. <laughs> I think in the video they're wearing socks with this outfit. So about right here. and connect just like the other side and pop it out and same thing here curve out and connect okay so then now we can finally come back up to the arm area so she has this sweater thing that's going on here and um, it's off of her shoulders, so let's come down and work, draw her arms. Let's work on this side first. So this arm is bare, so I'm just going to have it come down. Just nice and simple to the side. And her arm, hands should be about in this area. So come about right here and draw her thumb and then her fingers. 
And if you like, you can add a little one right in the back to spruce it up. Okay, so same thing over here, except this one is going to be slightly thicker because there is a sleeve on it, her sweater. So, but it's the same idea. We're just going to be coming down to about this area. So about right there. And I'm just going to go ahead and connect with a curve for her sleeve. And then right here, just put in her thumb and her fingers. There. Okay, so now to add some details right here, some creases for her sweater area. Let's come right here. We're going to curve right across. And you can pop this out. Just make it look like she has a sweater over her shoulders. And then she has a strap right here for her top. And she has flowers on her skirt. So let's come um, randomly. I'm just going to add these flowers really quickly. Here and there. some come out right here parts of it there and uh, let's see here and let's finish off her hair so let's bring this nicely straight down and I'm gonna tuck it clear it out a tiny bit and I'm just gonna go ahead and tuck it in right here with some zigzags and same thing over here. There. And last but not least, let's, um, she has this wording thing here on her sweater, but I'm just gonna add a heart <laughs> and make her my Lisa from Blackpink's ice cream video. So I really hope you love how Lisa turned out and made this fun and easy for you to draw along with me. And definitely check out my Blackpink playlist for all the other, um, I've drawn uh, Jenny and Rose, and now it's Lisa. And so I still have Jisoo left. So if you want me to draw her as well from this ice cream video, definitely comment below. Thanks so much for watching. And if you loved it, please make sure to subscribe and turn on your notification bell so you won't miss any new Draw So Cute videos. See you later.